Welcome to episode 2 of How to Play Ark with me, Space Panda. In today's video I'm going to show you how to kill a dino and cook up its meat. But first of all, we need to find something. I'm going to look for something small to start with, a dodo or a dilo. I can see some dilos across the river. Let's go over there. Sometimes you might have the urge to run, like a T-Rex is chasing you or something. On the PC you press um, the directional button followed with shift. You can hear a panting to indicate that you are running and not walking. On the Xbox you, s you press down on the left joystick and then when you want to stop running you press down on the left joystick again. So I've chosen to run down the beach before crossing the water um, because I know it's shallow here. Why am I crossing in the shallows? Well because in the deeper parts of the water there is quite often mega piranhas which we are not capable of taking on at this precise moment. Um, ooh, a dodo. Dodos are the easiest things to kill. Even if you don't have a weapon you can simply um, punch it. Or a compi. I wasn't prepared for that. And here comes his mate. So you, as you saw, I could punch it. Or I can get my spear out. Put the crosshair in the general direction. And away it goes. Uh, once it's dead, uh, the body decomposes in um, about five minutes. I could come back and gather it. But I'm just going to go ahead and hit it and it, the game gathers its hide and its um, meat. Now unfortunately we have a casualty of war. The poor dodo. But that's okay, we can use it. We have the option to drag its body up, up the beach. Oh, hello. That's one spear broken already. Any more? Okay, so we have the option of gathering um, meat and hide, as you saw with a spear. Um, if you use your axe, you get more hide than meat. And if you use your pickaxe, you get more meat than hide. I actually want hide more than I want meat at the moment. So I go ahead and hit it with the hatchet. I keep calling it an axe, that's because I'm English and it's an axe. So... What do we have from that? We have gathered 15 raw meat. We have another level up. And 20 hide. Um, I'm actually going to increase my health now. And I'm going to learn a slingshot. So that is how to kill an animal. Wasn't quite how I envisaged showing you, all a bit rushed. Uh, but basically, you get your weapon out. If you don't have any weapons, you use your fist. Aim in the general direction of whatever's attacking you or whatever it is you want to kill. Um, and use the left button on the PC, uh, on the mouse, and the right trigger on the Xbox. So we have some meat, we have some hide. Um, we want to go ahead and cook up the meat. So let's find a nice spot. I usually try and do things where I have something to put my back against. So just here. Check around the area. So to cook meat, I will need a campfire. So go into my inventory. Click on craftables. Go back to the main menu. Uh, the campfire you can find under structures. Cooking and it will give us a rundown of what we need. Um, we have enough thatch, we have enough stone, we have enough wood, uh, but we do need one flint. As I said in a previous uh, video, pickaxe is best to get flint from stone, whereas the axe is better to get stone. So we have three flint now. Let's go back into the inventory, click on craftables, 
We can make two campfires, I only want one. Now if you don't have something in your, in your um, hotbar and you want to use it, go ahead, you click on it and you can use Use Item. Come out of the inventory and you'll see there there is an outline in green of, of a campfire. Now if it turns red it basically means that it's obstructed and you can't place it there. Some things you can place directly on the ground like the campfire, other things you, as you advance through the game um, you will need to put them on um, a structure like a foundation. So let's go ahead and place that there. I place that by clicking the left mouse on the PC and the right trigger on the Xbox. So as you look at the campfire you can see you've got some options. It says press E to access inven inventory. Now on the Xbox it says Y to access the inventory but what you'll find later on is as you add things to the campfire um, the access inventory on the Xbox you have to hold the Y and then you have to move the option to access inv inventory which is a really long way winded way of doing it and I don't know why they haven't made it more obvious that if you just look at the object that has an inventory and click X you'll go directly into it so I would suggest on the Xbox using X to um, look inside something. So if we go ahead and press E on the PC, X on the Xbox. Um, in order to cook some meat in everyday life you would need a fire. To make fire you would need wood. Um, you can transfer the whole stack by pressing T on the um, PC. or not. There we go. On the Xbox if you want to transfer the entire stack um, you would highlight it and press and hold A. Sometimes we don't want to use a complete stack and I want to actually only use half of it so on the PC you click and hold down shift and then T and it will go ahead and transfer half or as near to it as it can. On the Xbox um, you need to press, you need to highlight it, press Y to split it and then again um, on the stack you want to transfer you press and hold A or transfer it over. You can also do it one at a time. On the PC you just double click and it puts one in there. Double click again and there's two and on the Xbox it's double tap A. So we'll go ahead and we'll put half a stack of wood in there. Um, and I want to cook up all of the meat. So drag that in there. So here we have the option to light the fire. If we forget to light the fire and we come out, you'll now see that it no longer says access inventory, it says light fire. On the Xbox it, it will be Y. So now because there is more options to the campfire, on the PC it's telling us that um, if we press E uh, we'll put the fire out but if we hold E uh, this dial comes up and you move the mouse around you can see we have the different options to put it out to access the inventory or to demolish the um, campfire. Let's go ahead and access it. So we have one cooked meat already done. I'm going to go ahead and put that in my hotbar and a byproduct of the wood, wood burning is charcoal. At this stage of the game we don't need charcoal but later on you will want to collect that. Now we know how to kill something, gather its meat and hide and cook up some tasty steak. If you like the video or just want to make an old lady happy please hit the thumbs up button and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Goodbye now.